One local man is now uh, a hopeful man looking for a kidney. He says his life is in limbo and he is hoping for a miracle. Reporter Chris Lucas shares his journey. Carson Reinhardt is 23 years old and in stage four kidney failure. I started dialysis about two and a half years ago. And um, ever since then, it's kind of just been going downhill. I was still working when I started dialysis. According to the National Kidney Foundation, that's severe kidney damage. I can't go outside and run anymore. I can't go to the gym anymore. I can't. I can't go swimming anymore. Carson's father says it's hard to watch your kids struggle. Helpless is a good description for it, um, but you just have to be that uh, support system. Carson has type O blood, which makes things even harder. It's good going in the other direction, but coming in your direction, my understanding is an O kidney can be donated to anybody. So it would be the next person in line, not the next O pop, O. O blood person in line. All these boxes around me are for Carson's dialysis. A third of this liquid goes in his stomach. Carson says it's hard to keep the faith. It's like I'm fumbling through the dark with no light switch in the room. Carson's biggest fear. I'm gonna die on dialysis. His biggest hope. That my life gets saved. The first thing he would do is travel to California. Just want to see as many places as I can. Another hard part about dialysis is you're not allowed to travel. In Maryville, I'm Chris Lucas. UT is accepting donations in Carson's name. If you would like to see if you're a match, check out the United Network for organ sharing.